Hi Scorpio, welcome back to my channel Little Love Stories. Today I'm going to do your weekly love reading for the month of November. Keep in mind that these readings are general. This may be resonate with you or may be not resonate with each and every one of you. If it resonates with you, you can take guidance from this reading and if it not resonate with you, you can simply ignore it. And for covering uh, every area of your love life and your person's love life, I will use this spread. This is easy for both of us to understand what is happening in your person's life and in your life. Let's get started. What are the... What are the Scorpio person's feeling and attentions towards Scorpio? What are the Scorpio person's feeling and attentions towards Scorpio? What are the Scorpio person's feeling and attentions towards Scorpio? We are having here Eight of Wands, the Empress, Ace of Cups, Page of Wands. So what are the okay Scorpio's feelings toward this person? Ten of Wands. What are these Scorpio's feelings toward this person? What are these Scorpio's feelings toward this person? We are having here Hierophant, Queen of Swords, Six of Wands. So, what are the mutual energies? So, what are the mutual energies? Ten of Pentacles and Queen of Wands. These are your cards and signs that could relate to your person. It could be any Aries, Leo, Sagittarius with this page of wands, eight of wands, six of wands, queen of wands and ten of wands. It could be any Taurus with this Hierophant, Aquarius with this Empress, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces with this Ace of Cups and Ten of Cups, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius with this Queen of Swords. Okay, let's talk about your person's feeling first and this person is uh, will test, text you. And in their text, they will offer you love. They will offer you like they are so interested in you. They, this is this is this person's love. They will text you about their feelings, how they feel about you, and and they feel love. They feel affection. They feel like that they they love you because you are so motherly. You are so nurturing. You are so caring. You are so kind. You are so complete package of beauty you are just sitting there and shining this is this person's feelings towards you and this is this person's attentions towards you and this is this person's attention this is the what they want to do with you they want to explore you they want to offer you love they want to propose you they want to talk to you because you are so like motherly and there is an overflowing love in this person there is an overflowing love uh, for you they can feel like that in this uh, you know after this uh, full moon uh, in this first week of november they feel like that they really love you you know they they can they, they really want to offer you love maybe there is someone new someone new want to offer you love want to uh, like they really see you like this uh, in 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 nurturing you are so nurturing you are nurturing your environment and they want to offer you love. Maybe I think this is some a new a new love offer for you, Scorpio. And yes, this is a new passion. This is this overflowing love, this attraction, this this attraction for you. They want to talk to you. And in your side, you are like you want commitment in your life. You want marriage. You want long lasting. Uh, commitment in your life and you are a little bit pressurized right now you, you feel like that there's a lot of work to do you are you are doing and handling a lot of things uh, a lot of work in your hand and you are like a little bit strict toward this person you are strict you are straightforward you are strict and uh, being straightforward and strict you are victorious in this situation you are famous you are uh, like a uh, really favorite in your circle and telling demanding what you deserve this is your victory you demand this your love you demand equality you demand respect you demand love for from this person and this is your victory standing up for yourself and telling straight forward what you deserve and this is your victory in this situation even you feel like that there is a burden in your shoulders and you are dealing a lot of things you are busy and a lot of uh, you are compressed under this burden and in, under this work 
but still this is your current situation but still in your feelings and in your love life matter you want commitment you want long lasting relationship you, and by demanding this commitment uh, by this uh, queen of sword uh, mood you are victorious you are like you did a right thing scorpio yes you did a right thing and also this person see you like you are a completion of uh, like love you are a completion of uh, wish they every co wish come true if they get you if they have you they feel like that you are like that you are a complete family uh, you are a marriage material they want to uh, you, you know this person this person want to offer you this and you are like if you are demanding a long lasting commitment this person ready to give you and uh, you are in this queen of swan energy eventually uh, you become so attractive you radiate these uh, appealing energies and this person like you are a magnet for this person and this person feel pull towards you like you will step into this queen of wands energy like so grace so like glowing and attractive so let's see what else we have for you, Scorpio. What else for Scorpio? What else for Scorpio? We are having here Seven of Cups, Six of Pentacles, and as an outcome, Ouch, Five of Swords. This person is confused a little bit. There's illusions in this person's mind. This person don't know where to start. And uh, you think like that. You are so supportive. You are the giver in this relationship. You are so generous. You are doing everything in this relationship. And this person is confused. I think there is two person involved with you. This is someone new who is confused. This person don't know how to offer you. But they, they will talk to you and eventually become a little bit nervous and confused. But there is a love uh, and <clears throat> a lot of emotions in this. <clears throat> a lot of emotions in this person's uh, in this person's for you, and they they become a little bit nervous and confused. And you think and this this is you are so generous. You are so like this person feel like that. You are so generous. You are so like. Uh, sportive you are so helpful you are so uh, like kind and generous helping others and as an outcome well that's complicated Scorpio in this November you will get into some kind of fight and uh, some kind of disagreement and conflicts waiting for you in this November first week there is some kind of disagreement maybe with this person or maybe with another person but because you think like that you are a giver you you there is no it is a lack of uh, uh, equal give and take and you you think like that you are over functioning for this person and that's why you are demanding justice you are demanding uh, what you deserve in this situation you are demanding commitment and there is a conflict this discussion converted into some kind of disagreement you will feel that scorpio these are your cards and advice messages i should have for you what advice messages I should have for you? Don't be an option. Shine in your inner light. Stop listening to sad songs. Believe in destiny. These are few advice messages in the end for you, Scorpio. And the summary of your reading is this person. This is someone you want to offer you love and a little bit confused. And you, you will uh, get into some kind of conflict. Some kind of uh, this discussion will convert it into some kind of disagreement. And these are a few summary of your reading. Hope this helpful for you. If it helpful for you, you can support my channel. Thank you so much for your time and your attention. God bless you. Bye.